Hello, Internet friends, and welcome back to episode Base Adventure in Heroes of the Storm Heroes League on Tuesday. Recording on Tuesday in the Cursed Hollow. I'm sitting down here with the freshest of kids again to hopefully not lose a game together and to talk about the patch notes because um, a lot is happening soon, would you say? <laughs> Uh, you need to fill my bowl, so we can talk about this later. Uh, what? What? Excuse me? I need to fill your bowl. Yes. I don't keep you in my closet like I keep Nobble in there. Only Nobble's in there. There's enough room for him to eat, find food. I know. I'm in the cage in the backyard. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna talk about this huge patch coming soon, and Dustin Bradder just released a video on the YouTube's describing we're actually gonna get season one, whatever the hell season one is. Um. So that's going to be happening sometime in the near future, hopefully before the end of this year. Soon, TM. Yeah, but there's a whole bunch of patch changes. Um, where is the all the heroes that got a huge rework were... Uh, oh my gosh. So Illidan got a huge rework. Kael'thas got a huge rework. Tychus got a huge rework. Uh, Gazlo got a huge rework. Sylvanas... Huge rework. I think those are all the reworks. Yeah. Yep. Those five. But then there are things like... I, I, it's hard to read through this list um, of the patch notes, which is just linked on your browser. If you ever play Heroes of the Storm, those are the watching. But you can actually just go through and look at all these things. And it's, it's weird looking at like all the different talents that are removed and what they're being replaced by. Because it's kind of hard to read this gigantic wall of text. But you, Fresh Kid, you've played on the PTR a little bit. so you. I did. So you've seen, like, the new Illidan, who's, like, a tank, sort of? He's interesting. He's He lost some of his survivability while being just as survivable. It's really strange. Oh. I, I was reading through the comment section in the uh, thread, which is just, like, reading a WoW forum or MMO Champion forum. So, like, there's, like, a two or three positive and then, like, one that's, like, completely, like, toxic and then one that's, like, totally wrong. And just, just like, repeats the process down and down and down and down and down. One thing I noticed about Illidan was that someone was like, Oh my god, you nerfed his attack speed on his ultimate. He's going to be trashed now and just dive in and die. But they neglected to notice that like his base attack speed was amped by 20%. Yeah, it was. So, And he actually gains more attack speed with his level 20 version of his ultimate, if you take it anyway. So he actually gains more attack speed than he had in the game right now. So like Illidan's stim drone is going to be hilarious. Uh, it is. I've seen it. It is. Oh. It's outrageous. Oh my gosh. It's because he's going to have like two-ish attacks a second. He's immortal. It's fantastic. <laughs> he's immortal. It's fantastic. Um, so we need a support and a special. Would you rather... Go, I will go support and you can... Oh, oh you can't Zagara. Uh, I can't Zagara. Uh, I can I can Gaslo. That's not going to happen though. I can actually Murky. Should I Murky? We're on Cursed Hollow. Huge triple lane map that I can split push on. And we do have... I don't know. Unless Did, you want to go support, of course. Oh, I can definitely specialist. I wonder what the team thinks of Team Murky. What say you? Because otherwise I'll go Nazebo. Well, I was going to hover Nazebo as well, but I just played him recently. So it's not a huge deal. Uh, but I, I kind of like the the Murky play right here. As long as you team fight with us, it's me. I like turtles. Well, that's that solves it. Stitches likes turtles. It's winning. But, like, if we lock someone down for Li Ming and Grey Mane, like, if I fish slap someone, like, Zagara has no escapes. If I get Falstad or I get Vala after they use an escape, then they're dead. And you got my roots. I do have your roots. We're playing Murky, team. It's happening. We're going to play Blue Murky, and we're going to ride the Blue Void Speeder. Because oh, that's another thing that is nice about the new, the new Hero League screen is uh, yeah. all 3D, so you can see your skins. Oh, you can see your skins... As you select heroes? Yep. Ooh. Even the little icons to the side are in 3D. Ooh. And that's the other big thing change coming soon is that we have pick ban. Ah! Oh! It's only taken like I, a year and a half. I have some quarrels with pick ban, but specifically for the first ban. Why would you have an immediate ban at the start of the game? You don't know the other team. Like, it's like it's not like, oh, they have dunk trade. We know he's great on medic. Ban medic. You, well, know, you don't know what the other team has. I mean, the, the Heroes of the Storm right now, with their amount of heroes, they're using two bands per side, so four. And to my understanding, it is a mid-band strategy where you get each team gets one band, and then you pick two heroes, and then you each band one more time, and then you pick your last three. Yes. Um, and if you get the first band, you get first pick. 
But if you don't get that, you get first, second ban, and then the next two picks after that. So you kind of have a balance back and forth. It'll change the dynamic, but <clears throat> in Heroes, I mean, not Heroes Storm, but in League of Legends, it's three bans on each side before the game even starts. Like you, you ban three, you ban ban one, ban one, ban one, ban one, ban one, ban one, then you pick. So it's I, the first two bans in most games right now in Heroes League will always be banning the newest hero. Always, that's how it works in League of Legends anyway. And you're probably going to always see Li Ming bans or Zul bans or Medic bans. I think a lot of people are expecting the Tychus bans. He's quite strong in the PTR right now. I heard that his Odin though is like not worth it anymore because like everything about his talent rework is all about his gun, and his Odin doesn't get any benefit from it. But but I've also Odin never really... no, go ahead. His Odin really wasn't that good at to begin with. Ever since it lost its health pool, it's kind of meh. I mean, Odin to me always was not about. Because uh, he, he, auto-attack build is where he is normally. You can build him a totally auto-attack build. You build him like grenade build. The, the Odin was turning him into a mage, basically. You made him a burst caster. So you can burst into team fights or burst to clean up team fights. Not to do like static assassin smooth damage like he normally does. So I, I never understood why that was because I just lost to a Tychus recently who took Odin. And then I played with Tia and we lost with a Tychus who took Odin. Um, so it's it's just how the Odin is played, I thought. Yeah, pretty much. But <clears throat> we'll have to see how that changes things. Do they have any stealth on their team? I didn't look at the team comp, no. Falstead, Vala, Zagar, Diablo, Karazim. Okay, cool. I'm just playing murky. I'm going to mark some things. I'm going to see if I can do my normal murky strat where I actually don't die. Like, over and over and over and over and over again. Oh, Zagar is down here. Um. No, don't kill my puffer fish! Ah, damn it. She killed my pufferfish before I could kill her creep tumor. Makes me sad. Yeah, 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 yeah. Who do you got top there? Or you're mid, rather. <clears throat> no, you're not. You're top. I'm up top. Yeah. We have Karazim and Falstead. Well, I can't do anything against the cigar early game, so I'll have to just wait it out, I suppose. She didn't kill that bubble. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. My game sounds sound really low right now for some reason. I'm not sure why. Hmm. But my headset is just low. I'll turn it up a little bit. So, what are some of the biggest changes to the heroes that you have you have actually seen? Like, what are you what are you seeing from your PTR experience? What's like the the biggest changes? Sylvanas' is alt. Oh, the mind control. Yep. Is it? You only get. <clears throat> excuse me. You only get um two and a half seconds of control of the character. So like, yes. is it as powerful as that because you can move a character like towards your team i guess or move a, a tank away is that like the goal uh yeah uh it's going to be a great ambush ability i would guess S if you're sitting in the bush and all of a sudden you mind control somebody and completely ruin where they're going to be yeah uh, it sets up for perfect team fights afterwards because hmm. it has a one second like cast time so that can be interrupted yes. and i'm assuming it's going to have like a sound effect that'll that'll play with uh it. It plays uh, the Blood Elf Lament. Oh, the Lament of the Highborn thing? Yeah? Yes, that's it. Oh. That's kind of fancy. So, like, you know it's it's going to happen is what what I'm getting at, yeah? Hmm. Yeah, but it's it's quick, but it can be really effective. I used it on a Zagara behind the wall, behind a wall and made her walk out of her base. What is their, their team comp is kind of... I don't know if I want to take Leaving the Dream or in Venom. Hmm, I don't know. Oh, there's a Diablo in this bush. <laughs> I'm going to take in Venom, actually, so that I can put some pressure down on something. And, like, push pressure down right now on this uh, Diablo. Let's see if I can get this uh, shrine while you all are fighting. I'm getting the tribute. Oh, that hammer just barely missed me. There we go. Very good, very good. We got to pick off that, too. My Venom helped. I did it, team. Murky things. Oop, there's, a like, three or four down here now. This kerosene wants my face. This... This, uh, Zagara has no... Not scared at all about my, um... Puffer fishes. She just attacks them every time I drop them down. Which is, you know, pretty... Yeah, I'm down, all right. Uh, it's a reasonable else, way to get rid of them. What else is happening in the new patch? Um, besides pick ban and all of the crazy changes to the heroes, 
Uh, oh, the unit collision nonsense. So there is a whole bunch of heroes that have dashes or movement speed abilities that don't work right now on, like, wards and the sight wards and, like, apparently uh, Sergeant Hammer's mines. But those are all changing. So you can actually do, like, kerosene dashes and dives and ravages from... Ooh, what the heck? This Hydra is shooting through the wall. We top, top, whoop, top, 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 top. Should I push or join you guys? May need the help. I'm going to push one more wave and then I will join. So I get this lane pushing in and taking out the uh, armor or the uh, ammo. Ooh, nice roots. Stitches is in it to win it, though. You're probably, yeah, you're dead. They got me. <laughs> they got you. I'm still running in because I was on the bottom of the bottom of the map. They probably got this one. It's okay. Being able to jump to uh, those unique made items things is going to be very strange. It's going to... Like, that happens in, in League of Legends a lot, to compare it again. Like, like Lee Sin can jump to wards. Uh, other champions that have, like, hops or jumps can jump to things that are, like, inanimate objects. So I think it's just kind of like a, a quality of life thing for certain classes that... Or certain class, certain heroes that have movement abilities that really benefit from being mobile. And right now, you don't have that option. Like, unless you have Ravage on Kerrigan talented, you can't even jump to allies. But then you, you you can't jump to enemy sight wars, something like that, which I think would be beneficial for her. It's kind of a small buff to certain heroes. But... Should be interesting. Yeah. Let's see. We're in Cleese. Let's see. Let's do compressed air. Because we're fighting over small spaces right now. I think compressed air would be good. There are two bot lane. There are two down here fighting the murky. Which means that's good for you guys. You have a power play somewhere. Only Zagara is mid. Do, 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 do. I think we have two top. Yes. Nope, never mind. It's just false dead. Nope. Okay. Oh, there are still two bot lane. Never mind. <clears throat> oh, no, there's Worgen face. Not Worgen face, the other one. Man, Diablo and, and Puppy Boy's uh, portrait while having there. That was the one. Oh, my goodness. This. Oh. Oh, Vala took the crit shots. I was going to hit Bubble and then I died. Well, they're pushing down here really hard. They're countering the murky pressure. So. Yeah, but I pushed a whole wave before I could... Yeah, I can't push this wave against anyone right now. They are countering me pretty hard. But Vala being down here means that she's not up top, so... I'm gonna die to her right now, but I'm gonna put instant poison on her to weaken her a little bit so she doesn't form up. I don't know why she's down here. Her team is going to probably lose that engage. Oh, gosh. You're... Watch out for Li Ming. She's really low. Oh, got the kill. Vala is rotating now. She'll be right here. That's where Vala's going to be coming from. Not where Murky's coming from. Oh, speaking of the pings, that's a new thing, too, in the patch. The uh, the on-my-way ping will now show, like, your path. Yeah, an actual direction. Yeah, so you actually know where they're coming from. Well, it shows the direction now in the little arrows, but it doesn't show the where the person is coming from exactly. So. Yeah. Okay, I'm countering their tower push down here. This should give us a little 10 when I kill this tower. I don't know where Vala is, though. Is she mid? She's mid with you guys. Okay. I'm going to keep pushing this. You're low on mana. Oh, no. Are there any? Oh, hi, Karazine. What are you doing down here? What are you, what are you doing? Should we with your team supporting them? You're not a special split pushing. What are you doing? Oh, Diablo. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> oh, you guys killed Zagara up top again? Damn. And mid. Yeah. Get out of here, Karazine. Stop attacking me. Stop attacking me. He almost killed me again, though. That's funny. I know there's something else changed. I know the map looks li looks a little different. The and map. a few other small things. The map? Which map? Uh, towers are bigger on the map. Things oh, like, like on, the, so on the mini map? See. Yes. So oh. like you can actually see on things. Oh, oh, that's another thing. Death recaps. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So when you hit tab now, it'll be stats, talent, something else, and death recaps. There'll be four tabs there. Yeah. I um, think it's still three. Oh, still three? I thought I read there were four. Oh, we're down here fighting. Um, the, the death recap is going to be pretty huge, considering that it goes, like, to the second, almost. Yep. Which is pretty nuts. Um, Shows each hero that damaged you or whatever it damaged you and how yeah. much. Like, your last four seconds of life. I think it's what it is. Yeah. Oh, 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 nice hook. Nice hook. I'm going to help heal this kerosene here. Oh, 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 oh. 
Uh, I'm grabbing the kerosene right here. There we go. Oh my god, I didn't die. Save me, I'm a little murky. Very good. Um, did Vala actually rotate around? No, okay. There we go. Oh, Falstead is here. Peel him off me. Oh, I didn't notice our Li Ming is riding a nice horse, by the way. I didn't even realize Oh, that. no. But she's doing fine so far. That's a, that's a dead... Oh! Uh -uh. Your Moonfire got him, yeah. Nicely done. Oh, crap. This Li Ming is going ham, egg, and cheese sandwiches. Don't attack the murky. What are you doing? Don't attack the murky. It's so rude. I love having Melpurian with Li Ming. Innervate is just too good. Too good. Did you take, did you take the improved Innervate or no? Yep. Oh, you did? Yeah. It's just the time. Oh, 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 slow her down. I'm going to fish slap her. Yeah. <laughs> I saw that slow and I was like, I'm, I'm all over that. So we are, we split pushed mid, or at least gray main did. Do I take the, I think I'm going to take bubble machine. Hmm, it's so good. Um, oh, a lot of new art in the new patch. A lot of new art, a lot of new names for abilities. They've renamed a bunch of stuff. Yes, and, um, which is, you know, just a, a ongoing improvement process because of the, a lot of the art they were using originally, if you played back in the day, you've been playing forever, is like, <laughs> heroes. Like, a lot of the art was like, art from like, World of Warcraft <laughs> in Heroes. So it wasn't exactly the greatest art, for example, because it was like, didn't really portray a lot of the art in the game. Um, should I have fished grab that? Uh, I probably would have died at the tower. But we got two picks right there. Diablo, we wasted his soul stone. That's good. We are rolling over this team right now. 11 to 3. Not too bad so far. Feels good. Feels good, man. Oh, 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 we're getting fish slapped. Yeah, baby. Oh, gosh. The combo is too real right now. That's why I really thought the murky pick would be great with uh, Li Ming and um, Grey Mane. Greymane has some interesting buffs coming. He has another, like, Lunara-style buff on the way with his auto attacks. He has a buff. Oh, he has a, yeah, his animations. But he also has yeah. a buff coming to Mark for the Kill, and it's still garbage. Oh, the the bullet travel time and, like, the bullet... Does 25% more damage, and oh. it does... And it travels 25% faster. Uh, like... At least I think that's it. That might be... Uh, where's the next curse? It's still bad. It's still bad? Hmm... I was wondering if it would like help it at all because it would be easier to hit now, easier to land. But uh, the fact that it misses at all, <laughs> it, <laughs> that's true. And that Taronda can do the exact same thing with a, on target. Yeah, for just, far less mana. Yeah, the and far more mark. often. Yeah. No, it's weird. It 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 might need to be a total rework. I mean, they did rework Taronda's uh, not Taronda, but Sylvanas' ult finally. So that's why she has oh. now the um. They, the just, they moved possession to seven. Yeah, it's like an actual little like talent ability now. Yeah, which it'll be good for her pushing because they like nerfed all of her damage apparently. They really nerfed yeah, her. Yeah, she's weird. I might die here. Oh gosh, like they nerfed a lot of her da damage, which is being made up for the fact that now she can actually mind control someone. So, oh my gosh, this Li Ming. Oh my goodness. I, I you know what? In, in right now, I believe in the peasant pony for some reason. Uh, no. I mean, it matches her skin if she did it on purpose to ride a normal pony plus the the right because the brown mare or whatever she's riding right now. I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna take slimy pufferfish on this map just to have some extra. Oh, they went boss. Oh, okay. What? Well, whatever. I don't know if they would go to our go to ours then. I mean, should we take ours just to counter it then? Might as yeah, well. probably. Yeah. Well, we need the our bottom tank. lane's far more open for us. Yeah. I think we do need some more deeps down here, though. Stitches help. I'm just a little murky. Blah. Oh, what? Stitches move forward. Oh, they are coming down to our boss. Interesting. I am okay-ish. Our team did not join us down here. Trying to stay in the tranquility here. I'm gonna grab Kerosene for a moment, just to stop him <clears throat> from chasing you. Yeah, our DPS didn't come down here. Please, DPS. They're, they're not. Oh, nice hook. Put my I put my egg up top on purpose to help split push top. Then we were hit it on ball hand. Oh, you got Diablo killed. That's good. 
They killed the boss, though. Mm. Shit. Yeah, it's unfortunate. This is a strange counterplay there. They went for a really aggressive... Ooh, that Falstead laser. Mm. Crap. Went for a really aggressive double um, boss play. But our DPS should have left the... Oh, another kill for... Yep. Yeah, we would have lost the tower and that would have been it. Yeah, and they went to kill it. Now we're going to lose even more than that. That's an interesting play. I mean, they gained a level back from that. I'm going to go kill this uh, boss that uh, is down here. Yeah, Murky has a lot of new little ability changes, a lot of new art changes. In the patch notes, this is like the largest I've ever seen these patch notes for this game. It's actually a little bad. Oh, a big thing as I'm hitting this golem right now, it reminds me. The Garden Terror changes. Oh, my oh, goodness. Yeah. Finally. So... They do so very little damage. Well, so the, the plant... The plant, uh, you drop a little pot that does all the AoE damage. No longer, no longer affects minions, no longer affects towers or keeps. It'll stop them from attacking you, but it does it does a debuff where it amplifies the damage of the Garden Terror on the target. So you can't just, like, drive by, drop potted plants. You have to actually, like, do damage to the structures. They also increased its duration. Like, it, oh, it's cooldown to, like, 25 seconds, so you can't just drive by potted plant. You only get like three plants in one full terrorist duration now, which means that you can't scumbag anymore like you could. You gotta defend this. Um, which is fantastic. That's like huge. Because that's the most annoying thing on Garden of Terror is that nonsense. Where you just like, you know, run by, drop a go plant. Go from lane to lane. Yeah, go from lane to lane. Exactly. Oh, we'll dodge the ultimate there. Oh, Karazin's right here. He's dead. Give Ming a reset for my death. That's totally acceptable. Oh, peel for her. Oh, God. Peel for Li Ming. Diablo's killing her. She's dead. Oh, we're all going to die here. Oh, uh, my heal was a second too late. Yep, we're all dead. That was a team wipe. That stun at the start definitely ruined it. Ah, uh, yeah. We just didn't peel for Li Ming. She just stood there, and um, I guess it just didn't protect her, I suppose. He hooked early. I don't know. I can't defend this. I have to go bot lane. They're going to get a lot off this. Got a peel for Li Ming. And focus there. I mean, we don't have to focus on it. But, you know, rigmarole this nonsense. We were way ahead. Now we're going to be a little bit behind. They're going to get a lot off this. They're going to get... The, the bosses are taken, so it's not going to put a boss push at the same time. But they're going to get another keep off this. We're going to be even on keeps. Maybe. <clears throat> I'm going to stop these golems. Or, um, or giants, rather, from pushing our base. Yeah. It was all clustered up there, so a lot of Diablo's ultimate all was uh, stacked in, like, a small area. To counter... Yeah. To counter his ult, we need to make sure we're not spread. Uh, we, we are spread out. It helps a lot. So the bot lane will be handled here. But we gotta... Don't... Don't... That's all they're gonna get, so just don't, don't over-aggress there. So it just had some good hooks. We need to wait for a hook on a back liner or something like that. Their boss is up soon, though. 30 seconds. Their boss is up in 30 seconds. I gotta move my egg, I think. Hmm. <clears throat> I don't know if I want to take and the shark, too. I, I know a rewind is good, but I'm not like a rewind build. I'll probably take both of the storm. No. Ah, yeah. Well, we've killed every single person that's ever been capped. Yeah. I'm gonna take both of the storm, though, so I can bolt in and grab, like, uh, false sight or someone. That's the that's the goal here. They are going to go to their boss though, so we need to yes, watch they this. Are. Yeah. And maybe waiting for an ambush. Could be. I'll go I'll go I'll go face check it. Or Stitch is going to face check it. Oh nope, they're down there. We can rotate around them. Yeah, maybe. Oh hook! A hook! Hook on Vala. She's dead. Oh my. What happened? I got stunned and lasered to the face. You did. There we go. The bolt fish slap to get Falstead out of there. I am really low. I'm gonna fight the uh, Zagara here. Force her off. I wanna lead her back to my egg or anything like that, though. Are they chasing? <clears throat> I think they're not. Nah, maybe a little bit. We Still killed. For we... Yeah, they have Mercs pushing, though. We didn't have Mercs pushing. Bit of a power play there. We killed both of their deeps. But then our deeps and our healer died, so we couldn't keep fighting. Yeah, they may still be going boss. Yep. They gotta go check. Go check with me, Stitches! Stitches! Good uh, thing in the patch note is the hotkeys 
for each individual hero. Oh, yeah. That's interesting. Oh, wow. I got blown up. I got... Oh, Stitches, you can't just... Oh, I guess he's okay. Zagara's stunned. Go for Zagara. She jumped away. I got I got Zagara. She's dead. There we go. Nice. I'm almost there. The throw pit. The throw pit engage. Yeah, get on the thing. Ah! No, their DPS is back. Oh, God. Oh, your roots. Oh, we got it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they got rooted. I'm going to die for this, but it's okay. Woo. Oh, Li Ming. Oh. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, goodness. That was so good. I'm going for the, uh, they only have Diablo up. We can't force him away. We can stop him from getting this, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, force her off. I'll get the, uh, curse. Oh, man, that was ridiculous. Sick was as fantastic. F. That was pretty good. That's some pretty good, like, mid-level teens, low-teens gameplays. <laughs> that I was, was okay. so close to healing the gray main, too. Oh, yeah, you were running in. Our bot lane is getting really wrecked, though. Uh, can Lee Ming and I take our boss? I don't know. I can't really tank it. I don't have the healing build. So, I don't know. We could try to start it, I guess. I can, like... I mean, you guys are all up. You can join us here in a moment. Oh, she can tank it with diamond skin for a little bit. Then I'll tank a couple wax. And then I can walk over here. And then bubble tank. Bubble tank. Ah! No! Ow! Oh, God. I almost got stunned. Oh, he ulted to try to... Oh, he Lee Ming. Lee Ming, baby girl. Bubble Almost. tank. Bubble tank. Ah, my butt. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, they're coming at me right here in a moment. So I'm going to move my egg uh, ah. into this. Is there a brush? Where's the brush? Right here, I guess? I'll put it right here. This is the best opportunity, too. Yeah. This would be it. Yeah, we're going to get a curse with a, with a boss up. Ooh, that's nice. Oh, they're right here. They're right here. Ah, 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 ah. Save the murky. <laughs> no! <laughs> I fish slapped the false dad to stop him from doing damage. So, oh, that mob betrayed them. They got stuck in it. Oh no! He's dead. The, that maw. They didn't move away from it, so it created terrain. Oh no, that feels bad. That felt good. Oh, me and Gray Man going push after. with the boss and win it. Yeah, push with the boss and win. Yeah, Vala stayed behind. Oh, oh, oh my God! What the hooks of destiny? Oh, oh my God! <laughs> the blink, <laughs> the blink slime. <laughs> oh, this stitch has won us the game. Is this Pally Times Alt? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, he said he likes turtles. Oh my goodness, he likes hooks too. That was a huge hook right there. I mean, he is King Stitches. That's the game, wow. Woo! Redemption. Mm. Wow, that was a good game. I don't think I've ever lost a ranked game on Murky, now I think about it. I think I've played three or four games over the course of all my adventures, and I've never lost a game, I don't think. I was like that with Abathur, and then someone ruined it. Oh, not me. You played Zagara with me. Nah, I don't remember who it was. Still one win back away from uh, 17 again. Stat screen, hero damage. Wow, Lee Ming went, went crazy. There, Zagara went pretty crazy, but I guess, you know, we didn't have a team. We didn't have any assassins to, like, jump on her immediately. We had two, uh, no stealth, as I said. Um, Grimmin did pretty good. Stitches only died twice. Props to that. I only died twice in total, so eight total murky deaths. Not bad. Your healing. Well, healing wasn't that bad. No, you did. I mean, you should overheal Karazine because you have an a AoE ult heal. Yeah. He, he overextended a couple times during the team fight. Like, he kept, like, diving in a little more. That's why I play Karazine super conservative and just attack what's safe. Because he dove in and he had no dashes to get out and just died. So, but I picked the murky on purpose. I knew the fish slap would help us out. And it did. That was really good. I like these talents. Yeah, Cataclysm full full blink build with laser on Li Ming. Laser for team fights and I guess blink build for finishing off. You went full regrowth and super roots. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um 
Zagara went, what the hell? Zagara went ventral sex. It's okay, I suppose. It helped Is that her. the area damage? No, it's the three roachlings instead of two. Oh. It's okay, I guess. And then she went mutalisk and then brood expansion. So yeah, that's good. Yeah. Falstad was full mage build. He, ever, he, should, he even took overdrive, too. Wow. Damn, I don't see overdrive very often. I don't know. Oh, all those abilities are getting amped up in uh, the patch, too. They all last, like, like arcane powers and overdrives last 10 seconds, not 5. Yeah, there's a lot of unique buffs. Block uh, oh, no. now blocks 75% damage instead of 50. Yeah. So it, that includes the people that have unique ones, like Brightwing has Pixie, Pixie Dust. Dust. Yeah. That one also gets its buff to 75. So does Lee May? No. The happy Feet on Lily. Yeah, Happy Feet on Lily. she gains one. The spell shield change, though, is that, like, it reduces all incoming damage, not just, like, one spell. Um, but it only does for one second. Like, it's one second of, of half damage to spells. Um, but if you have two charges of it, like Li Ming can have, she could be two seconds of less spell damage. So, yeah. Well, she can have up to four. Up but hers to four? is unique. So. Oh, gosh. Yeah, it goes up to four stacks. It's 50% for each each attack. That's why it's such a good ability. Mm. The new Battlegrounds on here too, which is basically an ARAM type map. It's just a single lane map. Um, That's all I played it as is an ARAM. It's pretty fun. Yeah. Dehaka is also going to be here on Tuesday, we think, next a week from today. Yes, he has been confirmed for Tuesday. Wow. I'll have to learn another hero and eventually get hit. Well, then it's going to be hard to play Dehaka in Heroes League for my adventure because he's going to be banned for like two weeks solid. So we'll eventually He's actually not him. very strong. No? Hmm. Uh, people are thinking he's pretty bad, but it uh, a lot of people are looking back at how people thought about Leoric. So we're at a weird situation there. Interesting. Well, people always thought Leoric was terrible and then he became great and then yeah. he became terrible again. Yeah, he just. It, the tanks switched with meta. I don't know. I'll talk with Airho about that when I get him on episodes in the future here. But uh, that's the game. Fresh, thank you for joining me and talking about all the patch note stuffs. Do I get a biscuit? Uh, half a one. Better than nothing. <laughs> Hit that like button if you enjoyed this episode. Subscribe if you want to see more of these in the future. And I will see you all in the next adventure.